My wife died in March, just before the coronavirus. And the hospice, Joseph World Hospice, really looked after her. It was wonderful. She really enjoyed her last nine weeks on this earth. And so I thought, well, let's get on YouTube because I write a lot of poems. So I thought I'd just go on to YouTube and read one of them now. And then we'll take it from there. This one is called Senior Moments. My world is changing in every way. Nothing to me seems the same. There's nothing at all like when I was small. I wonder, who is it to blame? When I was young, everyone seemed to shout. But now they just mumble their words. I catch the odd words, but the rest are in doubt. I don't like to say I've not heard. The family all talk as I sit in the car. I join in to show what I know. Keep up, Grandad, the younger ones say. We said that ten minutes ago. The papers were printed in bold and large type, but now they are printed so small. I find it so hard a strain on my eyes, so I don't bother reading at all. I notice how young everyone seems these days, bank clerks or the girls in the store. I was much older when I was their age, and I worry that a little bit more. I once used to run all over the house with never a worry or care. It must be these slippers. Why, only last week. I tripped, but there was nothing there. I met an old school friend while shopping today. We met when I went to the mall. He looked so old. And what do you think? He did not recognise me at all. At home, by the mirror, while combing my hair, it's grey where it used to be black. It was then that I noticed something quite strange. My father was staring straight back. I'm having a senior moment again. They're becoming more often each day. Whatever were we talking about? I forgot what I wanted to say.